Hello and welcome to this video brought to you by Lois Art. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to use auto rig and um, pooper. So let's get started. I have the simple character here and I have the auto rig add on any board. So I want to rig this character and automatically apply animation onto the character. Uh, so let's create a rig. So I'm going to use the smart rig and select this object. Let's do um, full body. We'll add the neck. The chin, shoulders, wrist, spine, ankle. And I think we're all set. So we'll not play with any other settings. Just want to um, use the default one. So I'm going to click on go. Let it do its thing. Okay, so it's done and I will inspect it and see if I need to adjust anything. Okay, so once you're happy, uh, we can do the match to rig. And then I'm gonna select this character, shift select the rig, go to skin and hit bind. Okay, so it should be done. And here we have a walking rig. Okay, um, so uh, to apply animation with Pupa is pretty straightforward. You just go to Pupa, animation. Uh, you go to the rig preset. So it ships with auto rig presets and, and different um, variation of that. In case you're not getting the right result or the formation with one, you can try another one. Uh, so I'm going to select version 2 and select the rig and uh, click on preview. So it applied the animation and the deformations are good. Uh, for some reason it walks right off the back, uh, which is not supposed to be so. Um, but uh, what I wanted to use, I wanted to use this opportunity to kind of show you one feature um so pupa kind of I, w works well with auto rig pro and the reason for that is sometimes if you let's say if you don't have the auto rig enabled uh you might not have this um cool uh automatic retargeting um so one thing you want to do especially if you see that the leg is not moving you probably want to go and switch it um from from um ik to from ik to fk basically and Pupa does that for you uh here too so you can just click on switch to ik rig and Pupa switches it for you uh, you can switch it back to fk so if you're having problem where like the leg is not moving or the hand is not moving but the rest of the body are moving um that's because you just basically need to switch it from ik to fk and like i said Pupa does that automatically for you so um, you can just click on this and it does that. So let's try another animation. There you go. Yeah, so this is just a fun process. Um, you have, you can use basically any feature here. You can tilt the neck, adjust the arm, shoulder play with the animation settings you can isolate some bones that you don't want to work and then you basically have a lot of control to play with it so i've been getting a lot of questions regarding this that's why i wanted to put out this video um so that's how you kind of get started with auto rig and popa um yeah so that's it for this video i hope it was helpful if you have any questions you can leave it in the comment or email me and yeah so bye bye for now see you guys next time